Hello everybody, The Quiet Atheist here. Today we're going to be talking about a 64 year old woman from the UK who is an atheist. And just to shed a little bit of light on her, I'm going to read a little bit of this article to you guys to let you guys know who she is and what she is doing here in the United States. So with that said, let's get on to the piece of article that I want to share with you guys. Margaret Dowdy, a 64 year old woman from the UK who has spent the past 30 plus years in the US is in the process of applying for United States citizenship and happens to be an atheist. She is currently a permanent resident running nonprofit adult literacy organizations doing her part to enrich the lives of American citizens. Now what she's doing here is having a positive outcome in society. She's helping others read. She's helping others you know, come up with their own ideas. You know, she's contributing to society in a good way. However, there's this one particular problem. When she applied for her U.S. citizenship, she was asked all of these things, you know, in particular about religion, whatnot, and they're in the process of denying her citizenship because she's an atheist. They told her that she has to have a good, strong church foundation to verify her good standings as a human being. And to me, that's sad and pathetic. Because she's obviously a human being. She's helping these individuals better their lives in one way or the other. She is a positive individual, indeed. But see, these religious individuals want to get their religious beliefs in the way and automatically judge this woman and not give her the citizenship that she deserves. To me, I think that's a problem. To me, I think that's one of the reasons why, in a lot of ways, I think America is going downhill. It's because of these religious beliefs prohibiting individuals from doing what they want to do. And these religious individuals that are involved don't care if this woman is doing good or contributing to society in a good way. It's because of their religious beliefs. And that is a problem, like I said before. And that's something that really angers me, because this woman deserves the right to have her American citizenship. And like I said before, she is having a positive outcome in society. She contributes to society. And she does what she can to help American citizens do what they need to do, better themselves. And that is a good thing. But like I said before, religion is the problem here. It is prohibiting her from doing what she wants to do and that is getting American citizenship but let me know what you guys think about this you know because every once in a while I see stories like this and it really you know <clears throat> disappoints me so to speak you know and it's sad when people have to have their religious beliefs get in the way and not allow other people to further their positive influence in society you know and that's a big problem in my eyes, you know. But like I said, you know, let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. The article in its entirety will be provided in the description below for you guys to take a look at. And um, let me know what you guys think, you know, because they gave her till the 21st, I believe, to come up with a good church foundation, you know, you know, to verify her goodness, so to speak. And uh, they obviously know that she's an atheist, but they're going to deny her citizenship, you know, unless she can come up with this foundation. And um, the 21st is the deadline, I believe. It's in the article. And uh, if she can't prove this foundation that they want her to have, they're basically going to deny her her citizenship. And I think that is totally wrong. You know, she, like I said, is contributing to society. She's bettering American citizens in so many ways, you know. And I think this woman should be allowed to have American citizenship. You know, it doesn't matter if she's an atheist, you know. And this is, just goes to show that discrimination amongst atheists in the United States is there. I mean, it does exist. And it creates problems for individuals that want to contribute to society, that want to help American citizens, that want to put an effort into society, you know. And I have a big problem with that. 
But let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. You know, feel free to share my video with anyone that might be interested, whether it be on Facebook, Google Plus, Twitter, wherever you guys hang out. Anyway, the quiet atheist is out. And remember guys, if you can't be good, be good at it. See you next time. Okay, I've had my say, now it's your turn. Please subscribe, rate, make a comment, let me know what you think of this video. Your opinion is important to me. Thanks for watching. <laughs>